Hello, hello, and welcome to Games Revisited. It is episode 64, and we're continuing our playthrough of Chrono Trigger. We spent we spent a full episode just trying to knock the zeal out of this place. Sorry, bad joke. And now we're getting ready to find out what happens now that we beat her not once, not twice, but thrice. So... As we left off on our cliffhanger previously on Chrono Trigger. How dare you vermin hound my steps? O oh, almighty Lavos, lend me your power. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work the way you think it's going to work, lady. This place going down. <laughs> At last Lavo stirs, before him you are as grist before the wheel, but I, I shall attain immortality. Queen Zeal has a very bassy voice. Who would have thought? Bye bye crazy lady. Because it looks like the Black Omen's going down. Well, doesn't this look familiar? Yep. Here we go. Lavos Rising. Do we sing it to the tune of Bad Moon Rising? I see Lavos. No. Okay. Sorry. Lavos enters attack mode. Lavos can go eat a lightning bolt. So here's the basic idea. In this version, Lavos is going to run through each of the each of nine modes. So the first go around, he's going to be like the dragon tank, and the extra little bits are going to be the other parts of the dragon tank, and then the guardian, and then Hecron, and then Zombor, and so on and so forth. Um, he's going to cycle through the basic attack mode of all the major enemies that we've gone through thus far. Um, so, yeah. Just double checking. And, and then we'll get to uh, phase two. And hopefully somewhere between here and there we'll be able to actually bail on this and go get the content that we missed. But uh, it doesn't look like that's going to be right now. Alright, let's bring it, dude. You know what you got coming? A big honking lightning bolt. And... I don't even know if there's anything you charm off them. I'll try anyway. Oh, 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 that's right, that's right. Magic doesn't work on the on the part that I want to hurt. At least not lightning magic. Oh, does he have something? Oh, nothing but gratitude. Of course. Alright. Triple kick. Frenzy. And an aerial strike. Nah, I should knock this off pretty quick. No, no. Lavos changes attack modes. So now it's going to be kind of like the Guardian. Alright. Um, how's everybody's health and magic? Ayla's magic is a little bit low. I do like that they give you a chance to to take just a breather to... to Bump up on the potions and elixirs and whatnot. Uh, ether, ether. Let's get. There we go. And everybody's hip more. Or, you know what? I 
Seven, eight, nine. Yeah, that's worth burning a potion. Good thing we uh, dumped all our money into potions and stuff, huh? I mean, you can't take it with you. All right, so this is the Guardian, and this is the part where we want to defeat the sides whenever they're alive, and then focus on the center. I'm trying to remember what these guys are weak to, and this is probably one of those things that I should have had like 18 different tabs up. Um, we'll try that. And triple kick. Oh. Oh, that finished him off entirely. Okay, now we got Hecarin. So now it's going to be nothing but magic. So Ayla is going to be... A, we're going to have a little bit of trouble here because all Ayla really has are physical attacks. So let's go ahead and go with the charm. And then let's make with the, uh, the high level magic. Oh, nothing but gratitude. Okay, fine. Uh, if it wasn't for the fact that she's the only one that has charm, it would have been nice to have been able to bring somebody else along board. Alright, Lavos changes attack form, attack modes again. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, Zombor! Now this is where the top part kind of absorbs lightning and the bottom part absorbs shadow. Uh, I'm not sure which part's supposed to be the top part and which one is supposed to be the bottom part. So let's do this. Let's just hope a big old luminaire will um, get it all. Oop. All right, so the head's supposed to be the top part. It should be vulnerable to... Yeah, okay. Bam, bam, bam. And yeah, that was the other part. When it dies, it does the, the magic points suck. Okay, Lavos changes attack modes yet again. I, I do <laughs> I do like that each attack mode, it has the same hit points, strengths, and weaknesses as the thing it's imitating. So at level 55, we're dealing with some of the early bosses that were such a struggle before. And, and kind of burn it though pretty quick now. So now it is Mazamoon. So every time we see uh, storing up wind energy, that's when we need to do the slash. But first, we need to get. Uh, what is Amber? Oh, no, never mind. Um, no, I don't want to waste the Mega Elixir. I do want to go ahead and use one of the Turbo Ethers on Ayla. That gets her back up to full. And, yeah, everybody's good enough. Everybody's good enough. Okay. I, I kind of wish there was a way to save, too. I hate that you gotta have to run through all this again if something bad happens. All right. Let me actually go send these two on an attack. And then do a wind slash. And we'll just kind of keep cycling through that for a little bit. And this should go fairly quick. I don't remember Mazamoon having that much health. Oh, no, there we go. Done. Change the attack modes again. All right, now we're getting to Nizbal. And he was stunned by lightning. So we want to lead up with all the lightning attacks we can. Um, I don't know if I want to do Luminaire or the Thunder Chomp. Let's do the Luminaire. Then get these guys to do the regular attack. Man, Ayla's burning through the magic. Gonna have to... Oh, that's right, because she doesn't have the stud. Everybody else has got that stupid gold stud. Alright. Alright. Totally forgot about that. 
Like, yeah, Chrono and Frog are doing great. Well, yeah, of course they are. Oh, we're done with Nizable. Now we're back to Magus, and... The Miles Moon will lower his defense, and he's immune to all magic except the element that he's casting. This is where having Magus in the party would have actually been helpful. And, and I kind of... I wonder if it'll let me swap out party members when we get our next little break. Because it would be kind of nice to have Magus against him. That way I've always got something that can uh, be cast. <gasps> oh, good. Since there's nothing to charm, let's go ahead and pull this bad boy in. And that way I've always got something that I can cast. I kind of hate that that cuts my healing capacity down to just what Frog can crank out. Um, I'm tempted to swap out Frog and Marley. Uh, just because Marley's healing is better than Frog. I know overall Frog's probably a better option, but um, having an extra revive would be nice. And a little bit better on the healing side, but nah. Eh. Let's try it. Alright, uh, how is everybody's hit points and magic points? A little low on magic here and there, but not enough that I'm willing to, um, bring for more resources just yet, because I'm a cheapskate. Uh, although I will spend that 40k gold as soon as I get a chance. Alright. Ready, set, here we go. Doo, doo, doo. What you casting? Uh, shadow magic? I think that's shadow magic. Alright. Let's do a dark hole. See how that works. Oh, no, wrong one. Barrier change. Lightning. Oh, yeah. About to eat it. Go ahead and burn a heal on everybody. Nah, nobody's health is that low. Barrier change? Oh. Yeah, I think when he's at... Casting a spell, he's weak to everything. Been a while. I don't remember. Let's just do that then. And let's do that. I f oh yeah, I should. I, okay, I should have been hitting him with the Mazamoon a little bit more to weaken him, but it doesn't matter. We're at changing attack modes, and uh, now okay, Azela and the Black Tyranno. These guys are again weak to lightning, and we need to knock off the shoulder piece first. Then the rest of it. Alright, let's uh... Just to get people a little bit closer. Maybe... yeah. Okay. Alright, yeah. Okay. Luminaire! Oh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> yada, yada, yada. Ain't gonna do you that much good. There we go. Well, I probably should have Magus do the uh, lightning too, but... Yeah. Oh, that's right, that's right, that's right. Physical, physical. Um, lightning rod? No. Yes, lightning rod. Yeah. 
yell at me like that. Let's see if uh, we can get Magus on lightning duty, since he doesn't have any physical attacks to work with. Because that should lower the defense and all that good fun stuff. Yeah, that was a little bit better. Z Yada yada yada. Keep your yelling. I mean, this is the equivalent of the Black Tyranno, which had a he. Oh, no. Okay, done. Now we should be on form number nine, which is going to be. Ah, uh, yeah. The Giga Guy. Um. I don't know what I gotta do with that one. Let's see if I can get this open in a new tab. Oh, yeah, I definitely should have had this stuff loaded up ahead of time. Sorry about that, guys. Do, do, do. Tyranna, Yakara, Mega Mutant, Giga Mutant. Oh, come on. You know what? Fine. I'll wing it. I gotta take care of the hands and then the middle. Everybody's doing okay. And now some fire magic? Okay. Let's go. Let's hit everything. Then we'll hit everything. And then we'll hit everything. Let's just throw our best magic at it. Yeah, the water's not so good, but okay. And come on. Let's keep throwing everything we got at it. Burn those magic points. As long as we live to see tomorrow. Come on. I am. There we go. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I finally found the page I was looking for, and he had to go and die on me. All right, so not sad about that one. Um, all right, now. I'd like to keep Magus for the shadow damage. There's nothing we can charm off this guy. However, comma, I really, really would rather have somebody with some extra healing capability. So, I could bring Marley back in, but honestly, the... Uh, probably going to swap Magus out for either Robo or Marley. Because uh, Ayla's got the healing, but she doesn't bring that much in. 
Robo's got some healing, but it doesn't bring that much in. But he's got more attack power if it's needed. Uh, and he's got a group heal. Whereas none of Marley's are. Alright, let's do Robo real quick. He's also got the hit points to soak up some damage if needed to. Alright, let's do this. Leroy! <laughs> and a Luminaire. I probably should have topped off the uh, magic while I was at it, but okay. It's only got 10,000 hit points this time. A third of what it what it, what it is when they first throw lava at you in the Ocean Palace, because that's basically what this is. We're we're doing the fight that we would have done that we did at the Ocean Palace, um, but this time toned down a step. The one at the Ocean Palace is built for you to lose. He has like thirty thousand hit points. He do, his attacks do more damage. He hits you harder out the gate. Um, and that's just not the case on this go-round. Now, with the new game plus, you can definitely get to the Ocean Palace at like level, you know, 80-something. And totally tank that Joker and get a special ending. Um, especially if you if you keep the Prism Helms and all that, all that kind of gear with you. You know, the helmets that I forgot to equip on my people. Since, you know, Ayla was kind enough to steal one. Um, how's everybody's? All right, let's go with, no, nope. let's heal everybody. Yeah. Frog's got it. Well, he's probably going to have to hit himself up with a tougher heal. I'll have to remember to do that next go around. I kind of expected that to do more damage, honestly. I probably should have also switched episodes before that final battle, but, uh, eh, okay, not too bad. He is truly slain. We'll find out in the next episode. <laughs> okay, sorry. I, 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 I came this close to just cackling madly after that one. All right. Thank you for joining along so far. If you're watching live on Twitch or Mixer, hang tight. There's still more to come. If you want to watch live, I stream on Thursdays at 6 p.m. U.S. Eastern. There's a link in the description below. And if you haven't already, follow in Twitch. Uh, I'm only going to be actively streaming to Mixer through the end of March. After that, I will be exclusively on Twitch. Although if you want to follow in Mixer, you can, because that's going to be my backup in case there's a problem with Twitch. So it's not like it's going away. It's just kind of going on hiatus or on hold or something like that and either way go over to the youtube channel hit subscribe follow along there you'll get notified when new episodes and other content get posted so live folks give me just a minute to prep the next episode and youtube folks i'll see you tomorrow <laughs>